one of the most commonly asked questions to me is how do I protect myself or cleanse my own energy before and after every communication. Hi, my name is Akshaya Kavre. I'm a nature and animal communicator, which means I can speak to plants, animals and other species telepathically. And one of the frequently asked questions, as I just mentioned, is how we protect our own energy while we communicate with animals and other species. Personally, for me, animal communication has been a journey wherein it has just helped me become a better person. It has helped me connect to myself better. It has transformed me as a human and it has therefore helped me connect with nature and animals around me as well. So just communicating with nature and animals helps me just cleanse my energy also. However, it is extremely important for us communicators or for that matter for us humans to ensure that our energy is clean as well. So a few things that we can do regularly to help ourselves cleanse our energy is of course grounding. So you can walk bare feet on mother nature or do anything that helps you ground. I have a few more videos on grounding which you can check in the playlist list section uh, and you'll find more techniques to ground yourself as well. The second thing is setting your intention. So for me personally every morning and before I go to sleep I set my intention to allow my energy to be clean and unaffected by anything that is going on around me. Uh, so basically what I do is I tell myself to remain a hollow bone and receive communications without interpreting them as well as to remain a hollow bone with everything that's happening around me as well so that in case I see something that may hurt me or affect me negatively I have already created that protection around me as well and even before I go to sleep I will show my gratitude for everything that I have and I will also again once more set that intention to allow my energy to be clean so that's the second thing I do so first thing was grounding second thing was intention and the third thing is something that you uh, might want to inculcate as a habit in your routine is to have some kind of healing modality as a part of your routine I personally rely heavily upon intention healing or ho'oponopono and I do that every day. Uh, now a lot of people feel like oh that means that you'll have to do it every day for 20 minutes, 30 minutes, absolutely not. Even if you invest two to three minutes every day uh, just once a day even that would be a great start and of course in time you if you would like you can increase the time if not you can restrict it to two to three minutes every day as well so these are a few things I do to keep my energy clean and to keep on consistently being able to connect to animals and nature and talk to them I hope you enjoyed watching this video and found it helpful if you have any more tips to cleanse your own energy please mention it in the comment section below so that we all can and learn from it as well. Until the next video, bye-bye.